All right, it's Dr. Jonathan Chung again, and we're talking about vagus nerve stimulation and what, how we could use the gamma cord to help treat patients with migraines. So here's that gamma cord device again, and what we do in order to show you how this device works, we take the device, you take a little bit of electrode gel, you place a couple of drops of the electrode gel on top of the surface of this electrode. And basically, you're gonna find the spot where your uh, vagus nerve is, where you can find the pulse of your carotid artery. And then you place the leads on top of that area where carotid artery is. And there's a little switch on top where you just start to slowly increase the electrical current that is going into your neck. And once you're at about 15 or 16, then you'll actually start to feel your neck starting to pulse and starting to tighten up on you. And that's just the electrical current causing those neck muscles to become a little bit more active. And you may even notice that as you increase it, you may feel the actual muscles pull into the side of your face and into your lip. So once you feel that level of stimulation, then the activity is getting to the vagus nerve and the device is going to stay on for about two minutes where it will then shut off on its own. And it's quite painless. It just feels a little bit funny where muscles are pulling and you might feel your lips feeling a little bit strange there, but there's no actual pain. There's no actual discomfort that's involved with this. If I weren't recording a video, then I would just close my eyes and let the stimulation just go. And I would focus on my breathing. I would try to take um, long exhalations out to increase the activity of the vagus nerve. So I would do a one to two ratio of breathing where I breathe in for four seconds, breathe out for eight seconds, get super relaxed. The device turns off on its own. And then if you are a migraine sufferer, you could actually do multiple rounds of two minutes. And typically after the second or third round, at least when patients come into our office with migraines, you can actually, they'll actually notice that the migraine is either fading or the intensity of the pain has actually started to go down quite a bit. So it's quite a powerful technique. And it's something where you can have one for yourself at home if you wanted to spend the money on it, or you could come into the office and get the stimulation done either as a preventative or something that if you know and feel a migraine coming on, then you could actually get the treatment done to try to abort the migraine on the spot.